What's up guys, welcome back. Uh, one thing I haven't explained is not only do I hy do hydro dipping on the side, but I also build custom computers on the side. So I've got a custom build coming up. I've got a Landcool uh, 205 uh, made by Leon Lee. It's semi-modular so I can get the pieces apart. Uh, we will be dipping that pretty soon, but for right now, next on the agenda is basically I do have a uh, small Glock that I gotta do. Um, one thing I do not always recommend is a lot of these pieces here, um, basically the cartridge release and some of these buttons here, don't necessarily recommend dipping with those on there. I'm going to go ahead and try it just to see what happens. Uh, hopefully it all turns out well. Um, we'll see what happens. Alright, so I think what I want to do is I think I'm going to do a uh, speed form first just to see how this particular carbon fiber is going to look on a really jet black uh, material. So, because I never tried it with black, I usually do like a gunmetal gray or a silver, and it usually looks good. Um, but we're going to test it with black and kind of see what it looks like. Too bad. Pretty good look. I think so. I think I'm gonna run with that. I think it looks pretty good. Alright, so I think the first thing you guys are probably gonna notice here is I did a couple more tests and I don't really like the pattern that I use. So first thing you're gonna notice when I put this film in is I've got a much tighter carbon fiber pattern. Uh, that I seem to like a lot more on this particular uh, weapon. So we're going to go with that instead of the one that I picked out at first. And this will probably be my most complicated dip yet. And I'm kind of terrified because it actually is for a client.